Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you, um, I guess this close to afternoon time for a movie review this time. Um, I got done with this movie. I was trying to watch it last night and then my 4G was messing up. So I just finished it up this morning. So this is for the movie Sharper that I'm reviewing for you guys, the 2023 movie. So I'm going to discuss what I watched with for this hour and 56 minute movie with Julianne Moore, Sebastian Stan, uh, Justice Smith, John Lithgow, and uh, pretty much there is a pretty interesting cast. So, and I'll let you know my thoughts on what I thought of this movie overall for the runtime I watched for it. So let's dive into this movie review. Now basically this premise of the movie is about um, this girl... Sandra, also known as Sandy, is her actual name. And she meets a guy named Tom Justice Smith. Um, so basically, she meets him in a bookstore. And then they start going out and dating and all that. And I think maybe a few weeks later, uh, as their relationship is continuing... She says her, her brother needs th uh, money to pay off these guys. Well, she has to pay off these guys $350,000 just to, so he doesn't die or anything. And pretty much she takes the money and runs. Um, so pretty much she was a con artist. And you find out later on it explains different characters as stories as the movie progresses so sandra was trained by a guy named max sebastian stan and he taught her how to become a con artist and play the game and all that i guess you could say so pretty much sebastian stan and julianne moore are not good people in this movie they're pretty much con artists uh taking money and Screwing people over, basically. So, when you get to the Julianne part in the movie, that's where things start to unfold a bit. And the last part is Sandy of the movie, and it ends the movie pretty alright. So, I think I was a little impressed with this movie. The script, yeah, it it's a solid script. Not something I would say... Is going to be my favorite movie. But I think it's a good movie. In my personal opinion. I know other critics have been giving it lower scores of a movie. But I don't think it's a terrible movie. I actually liked it. With how the story went. And yeah the con artist part aspect about the movie. Kind of makes you dislike certain characters in the movie. But Pretty much overall, I think this movie, with its performance and the actors and actresses' the performances in the movie, like Julianne Moore, Sebastian Stan, did really well in this movie. The girl that played Sandra, also known as Sandy, her performance was pretty outstanding. And Justice Smith's performance as Tom was great. John Lithgow, really good in this movie, but you'll... You just have to watch it to see what's going to happen. It's not really hard to follow with this movie, but you just got to pay attention to each character as the movie goes on. So pretty much overall, I think Sharper was a good movie in my opinion. Um, there are some things I like about it and some things I have my critiques on about this movie. But I think performance-wise, it was pretty good. So for a score for me... I'm giving Sharper, the 2023 movie that's on Apple TV as of now, going to give it an 8 out of 10. This is a good movie. It will be on my decent to good movies by the end of the year for 2023. And yeah, uh, 8 out of 10 for Sharper, the 2023 movie for this review. Thank you guys for watching.